Hey guys, long time no see. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's been so long since I've done one of these. It's been over a month actually since I've vlogged and I'm so sorry. I had this weird habit of just like doing something so consistently for like a good period of time and then one day out of the blue it just I just stop and I don't even I don't even have th like thoughts about picking it back up again until months maybe weeks later um, actually I stopped kind of around mid vlogmas and totally failed there totally <laughs> I'm so sorry I have all these ideas for videos, and then one day it just, I just stopped. Sorry. What's going on with my hair? Anyways, I'm gonna try to start back up again, uh, be consistent again with my video postings. Um, I'm gonna try to do it every Thursday around 3 o'clock p.m. Japan time. So please watch out uh, around that time each week for my videos. Um, I kind of want to talk about why I stopped. Sometimes there's a reason, sometimes there's not really a reason. <sighs> why I just stopped doing things for out of the blue. Um, and actually, I think going to Tokyo <laughs> had a big influence on that. I was preparing to go to Tokyo around... Well, I started preparations months in advance because, you know, tickets to go to Tokyo around Christmas time and New Year's is really, it's really expensive. But if you get them like three months in advance, it's super duper cheap compared to what they would be if you got them like a month before. So I went to Tokyo, it was absolutely fantastic. Such an adventure, I love Tokyo. Um, I went to so many different places, ate so much food, met so many friends. A lot of my friends who are Japanese actually live in Tokyo, so I got to meet so many people. Um, quickly got used to the train system in Tokyo. That was fun. That was an adventure, but I did it and you know, I don't don't really mind it anymore. I still have my little Suica card actually. And I am proud to say that I never got lost once on the train. Oh yeah. But it was just a fantastic fantastic time. I met so many people. I went to Harajuku, Shinjuku, Shibuya, Akiba, uh, I actually went to Yokohama to uh, Jinbocho, I went to Tokyo Skytree, Tokyo Tower. Um, I basically went to all the touristy places. I went to Asakusa and I got omiyage for my friends. I wanted to get like the Tokyo banana thingamabobs, whatever they are, um, but I was afraid they weren't going to last when I got back to um, give them and hand them out as omiyage back in Shimane. I just did so much stuff. There's so many things that I did and I don't think I could fit them all the footage here in this video but um, I wish I could show you more pictures. Most of my pictures have my friends in them and I don't really have their permission to show their faces on the internet so I'm gonna try to get the most generic um, photos or videos that I've taken while I was in Tokyo. Eh, that was about my Tokyo adventure. Um, in my future videos, I kind of want to... Spring break is coming up here in Japan, and most say like myself, go home during this time. It's about two months that um, Japanese universities take off for spring break, but I ain't going home. <laughs> Not with Trump as president. Mm -mm. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. But I, I love Japan, and I want to stay here, and I think it's just money to go back for like a month or so. It's kind of a waste of money. My mom and my brother are thinking of coming up, so if they do come, they're probably going to come for cherry blossom viewing season. So that will, those will be interesting videos, I'm sure. <laughs> Alright guys, again, I apologize for not posting like I should have been. I might just make another video, record another video right now and post it um, to make up for it, but we'll see. Okay, peace guys.